Hey guys, this is Jessica and welcome back to my channel. So today is another, I guess you could classify it as a cooking video. Um, it's not really going to be cooking. It's like all in the microwave. <laughs> but I kind of just want to show you what I'm going to start eating before I go do my workouts. My boyfriend gave me this recipe and he said it would be really good to eat this before I go and do my workout. So this is the first time I'm making it and trying it. So I'm really excited to give this a try. So today we are going to be making a bowl of oatmeal that's going to have um, a version of peanut butter. I'm going to be using almond butter, sugar-free syrup, cinnamon, butter, blueberries, all that really good stuff. So before we get going guys, if you're a new subscriber, thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. And if you haven't yet, go ahead and click that subscribe button. And don't forget to click the bell right next to it to get notified of whenever I post new videos. Also, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down. It's whatever you want to do. And the recipe along with the macros will be on the screen somewhere. And it will also be in the description box down below, guys. So let's get going on this oatmeal. All right, guys. So here's pretty much everything that you're going to need. We have some cinnamon. We have our fresh blueberries. Um... We have some butter. This is the Danish Creamery. Um, I haven't tried this, so I'm excited to try it. I have some sugar-free syrup. I am going to be using some of my Barney Butter Almond Butter. And then we have this big thing of quick oats. Now, you can get whatever kind of oats you want, but I just got this. So... But before we get going on that, I'm just going to get some butter. I'm going to do one teaspoon of butter and then one tablespoon of almond butter. And I'm just going to put it in this dish right here and melt it just so it mixes into the oatmeal a little bit better. So um, for the butter, it says one teaspoon. Um, so I just took a tablespoon and cut it in half. So that's what this is right here. So I have my almond butter and butter right here. So I'm just going to pop this in the microwave for a couple seconds just to get it a little bit melted. So when we mix it in with the oatmeal, it's a little bit easier to mix. So now we're going to get working on the oats. So a serving size is half a cup of oats. And I ran out of all my regular bowls, so we're just going <laughs> to use this. So we have half a cup of oats and a cup of water, so we're just going to cook this for two minutes in the microwave. I'm just going to add my peanut butter and butter mixture. So now I'm just going to add a couple dashes of cinnamon. I'm going to add my blueberries. Then I'm just going to do a couple swirls of my sugar-free syrup. And there we go, our oatmeal. So now let's give it a try. Okay, so this smells really good. Let's just try some just oatmeal first. That's really good. Let's try some with a blueberry. Mmm. Oh yeah. <laughs> this is so good. And you can see it makes a shit ton of oatmeal. So this is definitely going to keep you full for a long, long time. And some of the benefits of oats. So some of the benefits that oats or oatmeal can give you is it lowers your blood pressure, lowers your cholesterol, it helps your digestion, it keeps you full for a long periods of time, and it fuels your body, and it also helps heart disease. And the macros really are good. So for this entire bowl, 
It's 380 calories, 22 grams of fat, 31 and a half carbs, and eight protein. So that's really not that bad. And it tastes so yummy. Mm. I'm definitely going to be having this every morning before I go for my workout. So definitely try this recipe and you can, you know, add whatever you want into it. I'm sure you could add some nuts. You know, you could put some of the chocolate almond butter if you wanted to. It's whatever you want to put into it. But thank you to my boyfriend for giving me this recipe. It's one of my, gonna be one of my new staples now. Um, but yeah, definitely give this a try. It is a delicious. So like I said earlier, the recipe is in the description box down below along with all the macros. So thanks for watching guys and happy December and I will see y'all on the next one. Bye guys.